because of your self-interest. Whatever differences you have with the president, face the president. Don't go back to public officers. Nurdin is a public officer. He cannot behave like the way you are behaving. He is not a politician. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alameen. Wa salatu wa salam ala Rasulillah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam wa ba'd. Wa haan salam ayah taman. Dadwinaha. Baddanka. Kenyans. Wa haan salam ayah. Dadwinaha. Kunnul. 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 Gobolka North Eastern Hasatan Garissa County Waxan Rawa Utkiga Ina Kuddar Sado Fadliga Hadda Kadda Gaya Dukaydi O Kah Urjidin Amma Kahad Laayin Arinta Kusafsan Shalai Kaso Bahaday Madaxweena Kuhigayenka Waddanka It is very unfortunate Sidi oi uta aday ama ku hadlay sawa atta gareyna ayo The Director General of National Intelligence Service Marka horta wa nasib darro Haasi yele wixu ku hadlay Waana wix loo malayn mi karin Midda ogu hore oon rabo ina u shego Madax wina ku xigaynka Rigadi Gashagwa Nuruddin is a leader an international figure who is knowledgeable skilled tried, tested and proved a competent person to fit that office It is in record in Kenya Lakini Adiga Hadda we have to stay Hatta experience and skills and knowledge ko asagal ayay hay hadi ladda wakalo wahan umalayn aano kaad ayreyna. Midda kale in terms of experience, he is somebody tested internationally. He was holding the office of DPP and before that in the office of NIS and now again back as a director to that office and that institution. I want to assure you and I want to tell you what you are doing is unwanting or is wanting because Director General of Intelligence is appointee and he was he has gone through the legal process and was appointed to that office proof with record. Is a presidential appointee. But now, because of your self-interest, because of your self-interest, whatever differences you have with the president. Face the president. Don't go back to public officers. Nurdin is a public officer. He cannot behave like the way you are behaving. He's not a politician. What is making you to make noises we know? Because your plans, your secrecy, is known and I can say has been recorded and is within the president what you have been doing because you are in record for the last two months what you have been doing the way you are behaving in the country inciting public ethnicity that is unwanting you don't seem to be the the deputy president of the Republic of Kenya. As a nation, we are in record. A law-abiding citizen. We are in record when the general election was, or was conducted last year, or 2022, the way we behave. But because of your self-interest, 
Now you are creating enmity between ethnic or class or communities. You have been so many times to Mount Kenya region, saying Mount Kenya, Mount Kenya, Mount Kenya. Mount Kenya is not different or has no more right than any other Kenyan from any other part of the country. But because you are hiding your motive, your objective in politics and behind the people, now you are talking about inciting and with record we can prove or it is it is has been seen it is in record that you are the one who has been inciting the community to cause chaos that happened in in nairobi that is not something hidden so nurdin attacking is to make him not to collect intelligence and to take to the president what we are telling you, we are very awake. We can see what is happening. Somalis are people who accommodate any tribe. If you come to Garissa, the Kikuyus, the Merus, any other tribe you will find in Garissa. Go to Ajia, you will find. Go to Mandera, you will find them. But go to Central Kenya. Why? Because of your leadership, you and among others. There is nobody who can buy and settle in, in Mount Kenya. Why? Be because of eth ethnicity that you are implanting, you are inciting the other communities. Kindly, we are advising you, don't before, create before you conflict. 